Hi, I'm going to read Shark in the Park, another rhyming story by Nick Sherratt. Shark in the Park. Down at the park, a little boy is testing out his brand new toy. Timothy Pope, Timothy Pope, looking through his telescope. He looks at the sky, he looks at the ground, he looks left and right, he looks all around. And this is what he sees. What a nasty surprise in his loudest voice, Timothy cries, there's a shark in the park. A shark? Fancy that. It's only a cat. Meow. Timothy Pope, Timothy Pope, looks again through his telescope. He looks at the sky. He looks at the ground. He looks left and right. He looks all around. And this is what he sees. What a terrible sight, Timothy yells with all his might. There's a shark in the park. A shark? Oh no, it's just a crow. Caw, caw. Timothy Pope, Timothy Pope takes one more look through his telescope. He looks at the sky, he looks at the ground, he looks left and right, he looks all around. And this is what he sees. Tim's not in any doubt. What do you think he's about to shout? There's a shark in the park. A shark? No, it's not. And aren't you glad? As a matter of fact, it's Timothy's dad. It's time to go home, Timothy. Timothy Pope says it's safe to say there are no sharks in the park today. Now, what I thought we would do is make our own telescope. So, all you need is a piece of paper or newspaper or a piece of magazine, anything that you've got. And we're going to roll it into a tube, like this. So here's my tube. So you can look through it, make sure you can see out the other end. And then I've just got a little bit of sellotape, which I'm going to try and open. Here we go. And I'm going to cut the sellotape. So hopefully you've got some sellotape at home and some scissors. If not, see if you can um, find a, a clip maybe or a piece of string, anything to tie your tube up with. And now you've got your very own telescope. So you can then think about the story. You can watch the story again with your telescope. And you can think about Timothy Pope. Timothy Pope is looking through his telescope and maybe you can change it. Um, we can say he looks at the sky, he looks at the ground, he looks left and right, he looks all around. And then maybe you can take your telescope and see if you can find anything that rhymes in your house. Can you look through your telescope and look at the mat? And maybe then you can look through your telescope maybe and see if you can find a hat. Have fun with your telescope. Look through your story, look at the story again if you want and have a go at thinking about words that rhyme. Fantastic. Good luck. Bye bye.